It's a showdown of a small and flavorful kind. Alex Blue from Dallas and Jane in Murfreesboro is one of 10 Southern chefs competing for this weekend's Made South Great Slider Showdown. And I think you picked a title for this recipe that's going to subliminally influence the judges. Absolutely. Winner, winner, catfish dinner. I mean, right? <laughs> before you eat it, you should just vote for me. So. Exactly. <laughs> well, hopefully it'll be good enough to win, but we'll see. There's some strong talent and I'm looking forward to it. It looks like it's going to be great. Well, why don't we jump into this recipe? Absolutely. You're starting with some nice little catfish fillet. Yes, this is going to be uh, some great catfish that we dry cure for 15 minutes and then it's breaded in Anson Mills cornmeal. Mm -hmm. And then we basically deep fry them for two to three minutes. And while those are frying, we will be working on our slaw, and then we also have a green pepper Duke's mayonnaise, which is Duke's mayonnaise with a chipotle green pepper sauce um, oh from Cholula, which you put those two, two things together and it's just a winner. So it sounds wonderful. Uh, All right, so we got the slaw, slaw started here. Right, it's super thin shaved cabbage on a mandolin. Okay. Some, we'll add some white onions to that that have been shaved. All this? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Then we've got some parsley and cilantro. Kind of a mixture of both. That's right. And then this is a mixture of vinegar, sugar, salt, celery seed, and a little bit of oil. Mm. And just enough to kind of bring it together. So a real simple slaw. Very simple, nice and acidic. Uh, it's going to really help cut through the, uh, the, the fattiness of the fried catfish. And really you want bursts of acid and you want something crunchy, something soft. We've got a homemade bread and butter pickle oh, um, that we've got on there as well to add some wonderful. sweetness. So a lot of depths of flavor, really adding some spiciness with the Duke's mayonnaise. Uh, the catfish is just going to be amazingly seasoned. And then this slaw is nice and bright as well with this some crunch great. to it. While I put some of this on the slider buns, uh, tell me about Dallas and Jane, brand new restaurant in Murfreesboro. Brand new restaurant. We are seven weeks old. Um, it's named after my grandparents, uh, Dallas Carlton and Jane Carlton. Um, really, that's where my love for cooking developed. They are, um, they owned a general store in Bedford County and uh -huh. making fried okra and buttermilk biscuits and pancakes really just started my love for cooking at a very early age. It sounds like it's going to be a delicious restaurant too. You've got lots of, uh, you know, locally sourced product that you're serving. That's right. We source a lot of our proteins uh, through local farmers. We use Southern Natural Farms a lot. Um, uh, most of our vegetables come from the farmers markets in Rutherford County on Tuesdays and Fridays and Saturdays. Nice. And our menus are seasonal, creative, and we try to stay as local as possible. This looks like a winner to me. Thank you for very sure. much. I appreciate it. I think it. you'll enjoy this recipe. And I hope you'll come on out to the great slider showdown. It's Saturday afternoon from 4 to 7 over at the factory in Franklin. It's a fundraiser that benefits GraceWorks. That's Williamson County's nonprofit community resource center. Get all the information plus today's recipe online at newschannel5.com. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you for having this me. Looks delicious.